What's happening guys, today I'm going to be showing off some applications to replace the navigation bar gesture that brings up Google Now. When you swipe up from the bottom of the screen, you get this little gesture that will just take you to Google Now. It's pretty annoying at times, so I'm going to show you guys how to customize it or replace it. Let's get right into it. On most stock Android devices, including the Nexus devices, or maybe the Motorola devices, there is an annoying gesture that pops up when you swipe up from the navigation bar. Basically, this is a shortcut to Google Now, and for some reason I find myself accidentally doing the gesture. In result, that takes me away from the current application that I'm in, and takes me to Google Now. So I am here to share with you applications that will fix this, or provide an alternative solution to this accidental gesture. Starting it off with the first application is called Gesture Disabler for Nexus. This will be a great solution to the accidental gestures that you keep on doing on your phone. This application simply overrides the Nexus navigation bar gesture and replaces it with nothing. So now when you accidentally swipe up for the navigation bar, nothing will happen except the same animation you've seen before and you will stay in the current application that you are in and not take you to Google Now. It's that simple. The next application is called Home Button Launcher. This is basically another great application to replace the gesture with the selection of your favorite applications. When you do the swipe up gesture, a menu will pop up with your favorite applications and you can open any application you want wherever and whenever you want. You can add as many applications as you want to the menu and you can change the theme of the menu and the columns within the settings. Now if you don't like the option of having multiple applications, and prefer only having one application being launched, then now gesture tweaks is another option. With this gesture, you have the option of setting one custom application to open. So in other words, you're just replacing Google Now with another application. But wait, you can select different actions as well, such as bringing up the notification drawer, viewing all of your applications at once, doing nothing at all, and you can get the full version which costs a dollar, and you can toggle settings, open the camera, kill apps, and so on. Of course, if you don't like that option, you can always choose to go with another application called Swipe Up Utility. Now it's pretty much the same thing as now gesture tweaks, except you have a variety of different options. For example, you can use the gesture to go to the homepage on your launcher, launch the video camera, bring up a shortcut, turn on the flashlight, switch to the last app that you are in, open a custom application, and so on. Now you can choose either of the two, personally I would go with Swipe Up Utility because it has just better options in general. For the final gesture replacement application, it is called AppSwap. AppSwap will bring up a drawer with all of your applications to allow you to easily launch each one. The scrolling is smooth and the applications load up fast. You can also have a keypad to search up any application and you have a search bar at the top as well to use your keyboard. You have four colorful tabs at the bottom, and basically what that does, it color categorizes each application, which is out of the ordinary and I wouldn't use at all because, you know, it's just random, but you can still check it out. It's free. So there you have it, guys. Go ahead and try these applications out. They replace your navigation bar gesture if you have one. By the way, all these applications that you have here, they're free and they don't require root. If you enjoyed, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and share this video on Facebook or Twitter, and I will see you guys in the next one. Kapow!